Lima's definitely has some of the best food in the entire world. So when you put it in terms of being a recipe, you've got a little bit of chocolate from Miami. You've got a little bit of flour from Bogota. Take a little bit of maracuya from Colombia. I mean, even in there, you've got a little bit of European flair. Some Spain mixed in is, I don't know, the creme brulee top. Guys excited? I am so excited to be here with my son and sharing another adventure. Right now we got the taxi split up. I'm here with my mom. I got Max. And in the other cab we got Mateo, Manny, Patrick, and Daniel. What is the thing you're most nervous about for this trip? Um, just hoping that when um, the altitude. But I used to fly an airplane, so I shouldn't have a problem. Are you ready to get some coca leaves? You gonna try some today? Of course. All right. You know what they make out of coca leaves, right? This will be my first time. You know what they make out of coca leaves. I know. This will be my first time experience cocaine. Well, it's not actually cocaine. <laughs> uh, Does it get you high? You know, because uh, you know me being high is uh, another topic. I know just don't want to be doing this on the mountaintop. <laughs> That's not gonna happen with cocaine, folks. <laughs> There'll be other things in the market you can have that'll give you that. <laughs> this is a 20,000 stall um, market. It's supposed to be the biggest in North America, and or in all the Americas, excuse me. And I'm not really sure, but it's like catacombs underground of different stalls of all types. They'll sell fake shit, they sell food, they sell anything you can think of in this place. So right now we're headed over there. We're gonna get underground, hopefully find the witch's market, buy some things, do some crazy shit. It's a random day. Spider-Man bubble. These bubbles just fit. Spider-Man. So I asked her, Ricardo de Bruja, I don't know if I'm saying it right, but she made this sign with her hands. Ah, uh, this stuff? Yeah, yeah, the magic, the bullshit. Is that upstairs? <laughs> I can't find the market. I'm not going to jump to conclusions yet, but we haven't found it yet. It's all inside. So, thus far, we haven't found what we're looking for. But this is about South America. This is what happens down here. Everything takes five or six tries until you can get where you're going. There's no GPS? Not, there's no GPS. Nothing goes right the first time. Everything takes five takes. Come on, you show me how to do it. I don't do that. Come on. Come on. On your left, between your teeth and here. Put them here, put them And here. I hear like a baseball player. And you're good. Like I got a. After a few hours, your teeth will fall off. You'll never have to wash your teeth, your teeth anymore. Like teeth. I don't feel nothing. Keep, Just get high? Keep walking. No, you're not going to get high. When you fall, I mean, you're working. <laughs> Got her first leaves. Uh -huh. You don't feel anything. It takes some time. Feel something, and it's like it's taking up like space in my mouth. Welcome to Peru. <laughs> oh, we got some guinea. Comes from the finest kindergarten classroom right there. Tasty. I think I found my dinner for tonight. Say, <laughs> 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 Yeah. 
No witches, Mark. They no said witches. there's no witches here. We don't know where they are, who they are, where they're going. We're going to pivot. We're going to go find something else. We're going to head over to the main square, go check out the catacombs, and see what else of Lima we can actually find that's real. Wait, wait, wait. Hold on, now, I spoke to some of the locals, and they tell me that in order to find the witch's market, you yourself got to be a witch or a warlock. So if you're not a witch, you know, there's no way in heck you'll know the secret way to get to the witch's market. And you can't find it because you're a werewolf. I'm not a, I'm a werewolf. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not a... Oh, that's why you played the werewolf. That's the problem. That's the problem. He's a wolf. He's problem. very wolfy. Yeah. I'm a wolf. You know, I'm not a, I'm, I'm not, not a, a witch. villager. There never have been a villager. We'll never find the place. Know your birds. 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 Amazing. Plus we got another 128 gig chip if we run it. Okay. Roland? Just finished a walk around the Basilica. We're here at the catacombs. They won't let us bring our cameras in. So what are we going to do? We're going to do it anyway. We're going to do it anyway. Because we do it for the content. That's not right. Not for you, not for us, for this make-believe thing. Content. That doesn't exist. That. Right there. No, this no, no. It's not real. Content It's hands. not real. That's why we're hanging by a church. <laughs> and here you can see we have the white Jesus. Historically inaccurate. But one of my favorite fictional pieces. Nothing I enjoy more than a Jew being tortured on a Sunday. <laughs> that's what I live, that's what my Sundays are for. So the first church was built by bricks. And we were just told that the second was built with wheat. Uh, as Brandon pointed out, it is totally oh, free. There's a whole fucking reader thing, dude. I, I know, I need to really sit there. <laughs> Able to buy in the market, nobody sell food, give you food, no. He's being polite about the Inquisition. <laughs> See, it's VIP, very important pedophiles. <laughs> very important pelvises. This pelvis right here had 11 children. <laughs> We're under the church, it's where they cage the boys to, to breed them and prep them. They really had a, a, a great system. <laughs> Stay right there, because you're blocking that good light. That's good. You want me to hold that in my hand? No, look. What'd they do with the with the people that they killed in the Inquisition? The, the ones who are not Catholic, you throw them out and... Uh, throw them in the trash? Well, yeah, throw them in the trash, bury them someplace else. But in order to be buried under a church, you have to be Catholic. Okay? Now, if you were a VIP, you know, that means you donated a lot of money, you got buried underneath the main altar. But if you were not a VIP, you got buried on the sides of the altar. You took a lot more out of this tour than we did. No, I just <laughs> read more about it than you guys have. We, Rap, what's up? Hold on. Wrap up. We just, uh, finished, we just finished a hell of a day searching for the witch's market, which doesn't exist, or it does, and the witches just take Sundays off. We also discovered that church is out on Sundays, but the catacombs are still you know, people are still dead when they're dead. So thanks to Manny and Lucy, we have come together on this beautiful Sunday afternoon for a phenomenal, phenomenal lunch. Let's go check out what that's all about. Buddy, get your glasses up. Get your glasses up. Get your meal. Viva Peru! Manny and Lou! Rule 36. Rule 36. Rule 36. If you don't know what it is, don't ask. Batter up! We're on the walk to go paragliding with the Millers because it's bring your family to paragliding day here in Lima. And Brandon is going to be taking his mom paragliding.
a juggling class down there. I'm just assuming everyone's Argentinian at this point. Yeah. 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 Yeah.